It's time to rethink how you view haters in your life. Quit thinking of haters as a bad thing and start using them as fuel to your fire. Haters can actually help you achieve more than you thought possible if you learn to think of them in a productive way. The emergence of haters is a signal that you have achieved a certain level of success and are attempting to accomplish something within your life. If you have not accomplished anything, then almost certainly nobody would be paying enough attention to give you criticism. Maybe your dream is to quit your job and start an epic business that impacts the world. Maybe you have a goal to create a YouTube channel with a million followers, run a marathon, or write a best-selling book. Big goals can create massive moments, but they aren't achieved easily. The higher you climb, the more people you will have trying to drag you down. The better you get, the more critics you will attract. That's just part of life. Remember, critics are drawn to success, not because they're interested to learn from it, not because they want to know how to create some of their own, but because deep down they know that they don't have the courage to work for it. So it's easier for them to throw shade at your journey. Don't let their shade block your light. You can't let their words, which are based around their own fears and limitations, stop you from going after what you want in life. You can't ever let the opinions of others stop you from living the life you know you are capable of. When people are hating on you and what you're trying to do, this is a sign that you're on the path towards success. This means you're moving in the right direction and setting goals that would terrify most people. Use this sign as a validation that you've been doing the right types of things in your life. Use it as motivation to keep setting even bigger goals. As Les Brown said, Shoot for the moon, because even if you miss your land among the stars, your goals should be so big that they almost seem scary to say out loud, even to yourself. If your goals prompt others to laugh and say you're crazy, then you're setting the right kind of goals. If not, you need to 10x your goals. It takes no more time to set big, scary, audacious goals than normal, reasonable goals. Anytime you're setting a big goal, you are setting yourself up for criticism from others. But don't let that stop you. All the great ones were misunderstood and had plenty of haters along the way. Arnold Schwarzenegger is a perfect example. He was constantly told that his dreams weren't possible and that he couldn't be a bodybuilder, actor, or politician. Yet he became the godfather of bodybuilding, a huge movie star, and the governor of California. He said that he simply never listened to the naysayers. As he said, No one has ever done this before because then when I do it, that means that I'm the first one that has done it. He understands that haters are a part of the process of becoming successful. He always held the attitude, yes you can, and was never afraid of being different. When people hate on you, it's because you've got something they want. Haters hate because of their own self-reflection. Haters don't hate you, they hate themselves because you're a reflection of what they wish to be. As Steve Maraboli said, I don't worry about the haters. They are just angry because the truth I speak contradicts the lie they live. Remember, whoever is trying to bring you down is already below you. Don't waste any of your precious energy caring about the opinions of others. Don't forget, your biggest hater could be your closest friend. People pretend well, so make sure you guard your inner circle closely. If you have something that you want to accomplish or achieve or go after it, Ignore anyone that is telling you otherwise. Use them as fuel to keep going until you make it. You should be proud of what you're able to achieve throughout your life. Your haters can serve as a reminder to appreciate these victories and be grateful for all the good you are fortunate to have. Only you know what you are capable of and what you truly want to achieve in your life. You were born to make a difference with your time on this planet. So go after your goals so you don't end up with any regrets. Remember, if someone tells you something can't be done, it's simply a reflection of them saying they can't do it.